Hey folks, it's Chris Paul coming at you. Today I am at the Silverwood Sushi Grill and Japanese restaurant out here on off of 138, the back way to Silverwood Lakes. And the reason why I'm out here is, you know, I'm always about people, places, and things, especially food. But every once in a while I run across a story that just, wow, just hits my heart. And I, I just wanted to tell you guys about the owners uh, who are Jim and Sue out here. They lost their house in the blue cut fires that just recently happened. And I'm like, wow, I need to get out there. I need to meet them. I need to just talk with them. It's just one of those stories. Like I said, I think I told you guys that I saw, it was actually published on Facebook about how they lost their you know, house on the uh, blue cut fires. And I was like, wow, we need to go out there. So Roxy Gantz and I from Paint Party Junkies came out the other day, came and met them. And let me tell you, two nicer folks you couldn't have met. I mean, very, very nice. The food out here is excellent. From their sushi to their Korean barbecue they have out here. Let me tell you, thumbs up. And I also wanted to let you guys know, come and help out. They can use all the help they can get, you know, business-wise to help build back that house. Maybe their house was burned down in a tragedy, but the love here, I gotta tell you, two thumbs up. Let's go check out that menu. Jim and Sue Kim are hardworking people who believe the American dream was meant for everybody. They came here starting their own business and decided sushi was the way to go. And when they get behind that counter, well, let's just say magic happens. From rolling up those sushi rolls to firing it all up, all I can say is the proof is in the pudding. Look at these beautiful creations they made us and talk about delicious. All I can say is wow. Okay. Hey, how do you guys like the food out here? Oh, oh great food here. It. Yeah, we love it. We've been coming here for over 10 years and uh, I used to drive to work down this way. I love the food, brought the supplies to the family. Uh, we come here uh, about We come here every time we go to Silverwood. It's just great food. And the sushi? The sushi is wonderful. Yeah, you got to come by and check this place out. Lots of people don't know it's here. It, we love it here. Just listen and look at the Korean barbecue with short ribs, beef, and mushrooms. Looking at all this delicious food, you could tell the crew and I were downright hungry. Hey, here I am today, folks, out here. We're in your town. You know how I said at the beginning I love people, places, and things, especially food, but here is a special case. The Blue Cup fire, you know, took a lot of homes, and it also took the homes of my friends here, Sue and Jim, the owners of Silverwood Sushi out here off of 138 going the back way to Silverwood Lake. But I'm telling you, I've been out here, the food is really great. Come and help support a good cause, it's helping them get back on their feet. They're still here doing some great business and really, really good food. So before I go, I just wanted to introduce you again to them. This is the owners. This is Sue and Jim. Say hello, guys. And they're out here, great food out here. So when you have time, please come on, come on out and check out the sushi, the Korean barbecue, and also the Japanese food. The sushi is on fire. Hey, we'll catch you later on In Your Town. Sit, Mr. Cuddles. Sit! <laughs>